You're committing to fight for an independent Vegas battle. Let's do this. Time to end this insanity. Jesus, we gotta hurry. Ah, oh, there goes Boom. Good old Boom. Ah, oh, there it is. There goes the boomers. He died. Alright, let's get in here. Stop right there. No one is allowed into the control room. Well, guess what? Change your plans. Give me a second. Let's see. Hi! Nice to see you again! So... We can blow up the dam's generators, or I could route the dam's entire power output to the fort. That'll activate a certain army of Securitrons and set them loose to ravage the Legion. What do you say? Ah. Uh, let's do yes. this one. This is going to be fun. I'm unlocking the East Power Plant. Hit the manual switch, then go topside and deal with the Legion and NCR. I'm betting some NCR are gonna be hostile. Are they? Yep. Sorry, Boone. Hey, Boone, Boone doesn't. All right, that's a dead end. Oh. 
Battle of Hoover Dam seems kind of quiet. Quieter than usual. Oh. Hoover Dam Tower. Where's Boone? Uh. Wait. Alright, let's go. Oh, he's popping where I left him. God, what knows where we're, we're going to be waiting outside. Ah, oh, the remnants. Behind us! Oh. Sorry, Doc Henry. Move it, move it, move it! What the heck are those lasers? Oh, that guy, <laughs> that guy got fucked. <laughs> he got fucked so hard. <laughs> well, so these guys. Fucking idiots. Uh oh. The Leggett's camp. This is gonna be a tough battle. Taste my grenades, bitch. Bad. Are those robots over there? That gets camp. Where's the Linnaeus? I know he's I know he's here somewhere. Where's Linnaeus? Where's Lydia at? Okay, he's up there. So I'm not going to bother. Eddie, you better not you get yourself killed. I swear to God, if you do. And I got and yourself killed. Uh oh. Vegas, yet you carry yourself for battle. If so, you cannot truly be of that city of cowards. Enough words then. Let our strength settle this. Yeah. You. Yeah. <laughs> My game crashed. There we go. Stay down. Like that? Ow. There we go. Put him down.
You guys may have good armor, but do you have good weapons? Ha <laughs> ha I didn't think so. Where the hell did this guy go? Oh, hello. That shuts him up. <laughs> Alright, time to face Legendlinius. Or Kaiser's second in command. An envoy of fate. Yeah, 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 we already heard you. How did I? Nine DT. That takes care of him. Got some more flanking us. How in the hell are they flanking us? Thanks, Eddie. Blade of the East. Like it, helmet. Oh, but we don't get his armor. Yeah, yeah. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. All right, let's move on. Wait a minute. Deal with. Oh, we're not even supposed to. Oh. Or are we? Okay, let's just go back. Ah, oh, they're messing up my shots. Now the Linus is dead. Oh. Well, well, well. If it is a Caesar General on Lee Oliver. It's been a long time since I've seen the kind of work you've laid down today. A damn long time. And the screams of those Legion bastards as they kick dirt running east like a choir of angels to my ears. Speaking of, that crazy light show over the fort? What the fuck was that? Some kind of thumb of God you called down? Amazing. Fucking amazing. Could use a hundred of you. Just scatter you over the east like jacks. Give those plum fucks the what for. Huh. Here, I want you to introduce to my best friend, Yes Man. And, um, well, <laughs> these, uh, these boys with you? <laughs> Hello there, Smiley. Yep. Guess it ain't no secret how you, uh, I say, can you ask them to put their weapons down? I was just reaching in my coat to give you a cigar. Uh-huh. Sure you were. Let me see. Sure. 
Yeah, Figure screw it. Much. Eliminate them. Come on, you sons of bitch. job wrapping things up and I'm not just saying that because I have to I didn't want to make a big deal about this until after we won but well I found some code snippets in one of Mr. House's data banks that will let me um reprogram my personality to be a little more assertive basically so that's what I'm going to be doing and it's going to take me a while so it'll seem like I'm offline but don't worry everything will be okay I've updated the Securitron's targeting parameters so they know what to do. Vegas will be protected. So that's where I'll be. Off making a few changes. And I... I guess I'll see you around. We accomplished a lot together. It was fun. Take care. Bye. And so the courier who had cheated death in the cemetery outside Good Springs cheated death once again and the Mojave Wasteland was forever changed. The courier, with the aid of Yes Man, drove both the Legion and the NCR from Hoover Dam, securing New Vegas' independence from both factions. With Mr. House out of the picture, part of the Securitron army was diverted to the Strip to keep order. Any chaos on the streets was ended. Quickly. Chaos became uncertainty, then acceptance with minimal loss of life. New Vegas assumed its position as an independent power in the Mojave. Supporting the ideals of independence, the courier was recognized as the woman responsible for a truly free New Vegas. She ensured that Mr. House's tyranny was broken and that neither Caesar's legion nor NCR would ever gain control over New Vegas. Tabitha and Rhonda went east, through Caesar's land. Occasionally, tales of their exploits found their way back west, though few believed them. Eventually, the stories concerning the duo were collected and published, and proved to be quite popular with children. Convinced that his time as a gunslinger was past, Raul made peace with the idea of grown old. After traveling with the courier for a time, he retired and settled down in Outer Vegas, where he would spend his days fixing ancient machinery. Though the wasteland became anarchic after Hoover Dam, the boomer's display of power dissuaded fortune seekers from attempting to penetrate Nellis. Despite her departure from the group, the Brotherhood's peace treaty with NCR came as some relief to Veronica. Though she remained friendly with surface patrols, she was never again permitted to enter the bunker she once called home. Fearing for the safety of anyone she associated with, she continued her solitary life as a scavenger. Their leaders destroyed by the courier, the fiends scattered throughout the wasteland. Without the organization of Motor Runner, Cook Cook, Violet, and Driver Nephi, they were easy prey. After the courier ensured New Vegas remained free, the followers found that independent Vegas was even more unstable and violent than before. Old Mormon Fort became excessively burdened by the influx of patients, struggling to provide even the most basic of services. Arcade was proud to have been one of the defenders who helped repel the Legion from Hoover Dam. He was prouder still to see the area freed from the shackles of the NCR and Mr. House. Though independence for New Vegas was not all he hoped it could be, Arcade used his enclave knowledge and technology to keep order wherever he could. With New Vegas' independence formally declared, Good Springs thrived. More travelers stopped by Good Springs on their way to and from the Strip, and the locals grew prosperous from the traffic. The slaughter of the Van Graffs in the Crimson Caravan caused no end of trouble for NCR back west. Already struggling, NCR's supply line suffered further as the two caravans withdrew support until the massacre in the east was resolved. Cass lived to see the courier bring down three armies, and by her count, that was three more than she'd expected. She kept quiet about that, though. During the Battle of Hoover Dam, 
The Great Khans quickly evacuated Red Rock Canyon and headed north and east into the plains of Wyoming. There, they reconnected with the followers of the apocalypse and rebuilt their strength. Bolstered by ancient knowledge of governance, economics, and transportation, they carved a mighty empire out of the ruins of the Northwest. Thanks to the Courier and Lily, a cure for the Nightkin schizophrenia was found shortly after Dr. Henry's experiment concluded. Nightkin and other super mutants in the wasteland flocked to Jacobstown, and the town became known as a haven where a mutant could find peace. Encouraged by the courier to stop taking her medication altogether, Lily's instabilities grew worse with each passing day. Eventually, she became little more than a ravening beast, the kindly old grandmother subsumed beneath the rage. Following the Second Battle of Hoover Dam, Freeside came to be known as one of the more stable areas in the region. Ironically, NCR refugees found Freeside safer than most of the rest of New Vegas, where resentment still lingers. Revitalized by Violetta's brain, Rex eventually learned to balance the memories of his old life with Violetta's experiences among the brutal fiends. His mind had difficulty adjusting, but Rex eventually found peace with his new, more vicious self. Shaped up by the courier's advice, the misfits distinguished themselves during the Legion's attack on Camp Golf. Mags was finally promoted to sergeant, and the rest of the misfits received an official commendation. They continued to serve with distinction for many years. Though Novak was a low-priority target for the Legion, many of Novak's citizens died in its defense. In the weeks that followed, several bright followers returned to Novak to help restore its defenses, allowing it to remain independent of NCR. Armed with a wide array of improvised explosives and stolen weapons, the Vault 19 powder gang tormented the Mojave wasteland for years. Citizens of the NCR were favorite targets, and they always suffered the worst fates. Prim Slim proves to be an able-minded, if not able-bodied, sheriff for Prim. And due to his slow speed, some crooks get away without a scratch. But Prim continues to prosper under his watchful robotic eye. After their bold arrival at Hoover Dam, the remnants disappeared as quickly as they came. Legends of their power spread throughout the Southwest, a reminder of why people once feared the sight of vertebrates in the sky. And so the Courier's Road came to an end, for now. In the new world of the Mojave Wasteland, fighting continued, blood was spilled, and many lived and died just as they had in the old world. Because war, war never changes.